You absolutely have never seen anyone find a boyfriend like this. The girl held the clay and molded it. She wished that the next person had a cute personality, handsome appearance like her ex-boyfriend. She then threw the figure in the tub, then chant a spell to finish. The next day's class. A boy recently moved to this school. His appearance is not bad. Personality is also okay. Taking this opportunity she quickly got acquainted with him. Their relationship progressed quite quickly. All this is like a miracle. You may think that this is predestined, but not. This girl's name is Sabrina. Sabrina is a witch with immense strength. She used her strength to find a suitable guy. Because she's not lucky at all. Love is not long, then broke up. That's why she has to use magic to find herself a new boyfriend. Someone who can lovingly take care of her. But one night, her boyfriend suddenly took her to the pool. Then he even said many very strange sentences. I am a monster. You are the strongest witch. Sabrina didn't understand what he was saying. You are human. No, I'm not human. Sabrina was startled to wake up to find herself lying in the tub at home. The figure has grown a lot. It turned out to be just a nightmare. Sabrina didn't think much either. But a few days later, strange things happened around her. The teacher asked Sabrina and her boyfriend to dissect the octopus. But as soon as she touched the octopus with the knife, she felt like a knife cut her belly. Then Sabrina felt extremely thirsty. Even though she drank a lot, she still didn't feel enough. The teacher thinks Sabrina is sick. So he told her boyfriend Max to take Sabrina home to rest. There was no one in Sabrina's house. A boy and a girl at home will definitely have a problem. But when they were about to do something, Max told Sabrina to stop. What's wrong with your tongue? She stood in front of the mirror stuck out her tongue to check. Her tongue was very long, and she spat out something black. Her tongue now looks a lot like an octopus tentacle. Sabrina covered her mouth in fear. She rushed to the house of her witch friend Henry to ask him to check. Henry holds the magic light to check on Sabrina. Indeed, there is a problem. There is an octopus in Sabrina's stomach. A monster already parasitized in her body. This monster is an extremely evil spirit. They want to destroy Sabrina, control the world. Not long ago, Sabrina's group of witches had just solved one of those evil monsters. Unexpectedly another one appeared and then parasitized Sabrina. She wanted Henry to pull it out of her body. But when the stomach was opened up, the octopus went deeper. If the skills are not good, Sabrina's life will be difficult to keep. So Henry does not dare to risk. Henry came up with a better idea. Octopus are aquatic creatures. Without water, it would not survive. They ask another witch to help Sabrina with her magic. When the water inside Sabrina moves, the octopus will move there, and Sabrina will feel nauseous. After finally throwing up the octopus, Sabrina felt a lot better. She told Max she had an octopus allergy, but now the body is much better. But everything is not so simple. In the classroom, Max just bent over to pick out the pen, when a strange scene suddenly appeared. The classmates were suddenly motionless. They said terrifying words. We are mutants, we want to assimilate this school. After saying that, everyone held a knife to their necks. Max screamed in fear, he didn't know what to do. Henry was working on Octopus right now. He also hears weird noises like Max. Henry felt something was wrong. He runs to school, but Sabrina has lost consciousness. Henry could only chant a spell that stunned them. Henry took Sabrina home to continue the second test. But the octopus is not dead yet. It went up to Sabrina's head already. It turned out that this monster had completed its parasitization. Power lies in the brain. Now it can control Sabrina's spirit at any time. Henry thought of a better idea. But this idea is extremely risky. If Sabrina's brain were eroded, this powerless monster would surely leave its host. Sabrina decided to risk her life. But as the witch's spell metamorphosed, Sabrina became more and more painful. Her consciousness also fades. Henry wants to stop, but Sabrina disagrees. Henry used magic to freeze the aquarium. They managed to defeat that monster in the end. But it wasn't long before they were happy when the third monster awakened. It is ready to fight the witches. This is an episode in the series called Chilling Adventures of Sabrina. This series is about witches fighting evil forces. The world we live in is very complicated. If you want to see the other episode of this series, please comment below. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.